today we're playing Avagachi, one of my favorite Web3 games. It's a farming game right now, but it will be a fighting game. It's a metaverse, and I actually make money every day playing it. So today I'm going to show you me making some money playing the game. It's three of my NFTs I own called Avagachis. Um, oops. So, let me search the correct parcels. So, see all these structures, I'm building them up. But first, every day I get to do this, and I'll show you how much money that creates. So while it's doing that, I'll show you the different... So you can upgrade your... Things right, so let's say if I wanted to upgrade this, I need this many coins to upgrade them, but right now I don't have that, so I can't upgrade anything right this second. But I do want another wallet, I just made all of my assets safe by putting them on a ledger and having a hot wallet control it. If you don't know about crypto. I highly suggest you follow my master and creator, M. Sanchez World. So look, this may this much, but I'll wait till I do all three. Sometimes they, they eventually they will do things where every time you you do that, coins fall all over the map and you can go pick them up. The coins are worth money, you can trade them. Because I own the characters, I won't. But eventually, you'll be able to borrow characters. Well, you, you could do it now, but there's just no reason to. Eventually, you can borrow the characters, and then you will go around, make money, and whoever you borrowed the characters from, they will also make money. scale out Oh, the 
Did I? Yeah, okay. Alright, so... I'm gonna tally all this up after. And show you how much money it made. How much money I made today on just those three I 12 more properties, but I'm only gonna do these three because I just set up the wallet to access NFTs on my ledger. Link is in the bio to buy your own ledger. If you're gonna be playing crypto games, you wanna be sure to protect your assets. Go to MetaMask. Oh, it's not gonna have it there. It, it will have it in uh, Fireball.gg. This is a um, Navagachi project created by the community because Avagachi is an open source project, which is very cool. So, okay, today I made a dollar fifty-five here. Two dollars and thirty-three cents there, a dollar twenty-six there, and a dollar nineteen there. Again, we got twelve more properties. I'll make more money, but just off these three, let's say one fifty-five plus two thirty-five. Let's just say that's four dollars, five dollars, six, six around six seven dollars almost. Just on three properties. Of course, I have built those properties up pretty good. Um, and also these prices do go up and down So every day it's different, but that's just on those three properties. I have 12 more and in on those properties those things allow me to Those things allow me to farm more coins from the ground So this is why I like the Avagachi game and um, let's Let me show you the farming so this is the home page, this is all the stuff, the tools, let oh gotcha lending is where you can borrow um people's gotchis and pay them um to use their gotchis. So you could you don't need to buy one, but if you wanted to buy one, you go to see for an hour, you could borrow one for one ghost. Um you can lend out your own. Right now I'm borrowing these from my own self in my um it's coming from my uh, my ledger. 
I don't have any land in this. I have the lands in my ledger. Um, I showed you lending. Bazaar, you could buy gachis. You could buy one if you want to buy one. The cheapest price right now is 450. Um, 450 ghost, which ghost is at 133. So 450 ghost is 600 dollars. But as you see, I just made six, seven dollars today so far. Again, that's not off one. I do have three. I paid more for those three though, and I I paid more than the land is costing right now too. So land, if you want to buy the cheapest land. It's 48 ghost. $63. But as you saw, let's say even if we break it down to a third. Let's say I make $2 a day. If it costs $60, $63, that's only 30 days. It's going to take me to make my money back. Again, not, none of this is financial advice. This is a farming game right now mostly. But eventually it will become a battle game, an MMORPG, like big time. Um, but it's really cool, very, very, very smart people working on it. Um, it's actually one of my favorite games. I like strategy. I like um, to think through economies. So I have a lot of fun playing it. Um, and when the fighting comes, let's see. We're gonna, gonna beat some ghosts, create more ghosts. Um, yeah. So on that note, also you can stake coins and make some money. Um, if you stake your coins, they give you glitter, and glitter is the coin that speeds up the process of you building. And there's only there's only a limited amount of all these coins to just like Bitcoin, this whole economy is based on a kind of a Bitcoin strategy of is a maximum supply <clears throat> of coins. And if you use them all, there's going to be more expensive. So that's why this is very interesting. They have a 30 year road map. It's going to be very interesting to watch this economy. And I plan to do that. And I'll keep showing you the game. Of a gachi. Alright. Into the gachi verse. So here's another one of my lands. special tile these things cost money you can sell them the nfts as well these are all things that you're farming with so every day this guy's make a person is making money and this is a small piece of land this is uh the 60 dollar worth of piece of land so not only do you get paid from the channeling which i sold you i got two dollars each you also get paid from these so these pull up gems those gems are worth money, you can either use them in the game or sell them. So, this is where this game has a chance to, to be a very cool economy metaverse. Let's see what happens, let me know what you think. And on that note, I'm the bomb and I'm about to blow up.